there. Guard that place. We want to make sure that we have a guarded place right there. Um. Yeah. Then right here, divide half the men. Go send a good proportion of them to go right here to go break up this battle. Because this battle is becoming really close for some reason. I don't know why, but it's becoming really close. So I need to go make sure that battle is somehow won by us. Um. Right over here. We need to break up some of these battles. Okay, you go conquer Hong Kong. Yay, we're finally conquering Hong Kong. Uh, we still cannot quite move in yet. These two guys are going to have to move in very, very slowly up here. And we're getting there. We're getting there, but... The Russians are also starting to make a good grab over here in China. It's starting to tell, it's starting to get really hard who to tell. I haven't had those guys move in, these guys are moving in, they'll protect these guys. This is going to move in right here. I just want to make sure that these guys... Okay, these guys have retreated. Okay, good. I'm going to go send these guys over here to go kill off these guys. We need some of these situations to end. Let's see, are they conquering anything back over here? Um... Not gonna move in any of my soldiers over there. But Russia seems. I can't believe it. Russia's actually starting to get its stuff together. Yeah, the sun actually moves. displays some of their armies. Which is good. And they're getting a massive boost over here. They always get like 72 people. I don't know why they keep getting 72 people. But that 72 people is gonna be like the difference between this war because that's gonna like help us greatly with what we need. Okay. Move in, balance, send half of them to go over here. I don't know where all these troops came from, from just like... Okay, good. Wait, what? Okay, I don't understand why I can't do that. Okay, so now that we have... Now I feel comfortable enough dividing a little bit more of my military. I don't really have to though. Move in these guys and just move in these guys right over here. And then we should be good. Uh, most of these front seems like they're going to be one anyways. I did not stop this one fast enough, so they just kept spawning in. Okay, we're gonna have to start dealing with this. Because we cannot have any more of these guys come into our land. Otherwise... Yeah, otherwise this kind of happens, and we have to deal with that. Okay, so where are they going to? Anxing. Send all good troops to go to Zing Zing. And then the rest of you guys just stay here. So you have to. So very close, wasn't I, guys? So very close. Actually, I have a force right here. Oh, what? I was so very close to make it throughout this entire war without having any kind of rebellion problems. But apparently, it just was just too much. Okay, okay, we're almost there, we're almost to Beijing, oh my goodness, and then we're like taking over this, we're getting so close to conquering our war goal, um, yeah, and then this force is also moving in, that force is still not, oh, we just got some more men over here, sweet, go kick, a, go kick those guys' butt, you know, please destroy these guys, to destroy these guys. Um, 
Um, can I do like a massive moving in? Let's start from over here. Um, you guys move right there. 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 You guys. Just move right there. And we move right there. Okay. I'm doing a massive move in. We're moving up the line all the way by one mile. Actually, use these guys to go crush more of these guys. So we actually need more of these guys crushed. Okay. We are right there now. Now we're legitly right there. And then you move right there. Actually just combine all these guys. You guys move right there. Okay. Oh man, yeah, we this one is definitely stable. Okay, where are you guys moving? To Golan. No way. Where are you guys moving? To Golan. Actually, you guys stay right there for a second. You guys go send in your best troops to go right into there. You guys go right here. And look at that. That slow but awesome force. Shoot, how did that... Okay, somehow I left an, a big gigantic gap in my army. Oh, I think I know why. I think I got the wrong troops to stay. But at least now, oh, I kind of have a good advantage against them. Mm. We bait... Guys, I want to say this now. We basically conquered all of China. Don't want anyone else fooling you that we have not. We basically conquered all of China. And I want these guys to engage me. We're going to have you. Dang, they're still distracted. Okay. Move this right here. Oh, wait a minute. No way. No way. They, they would not let me do this. Oh, no. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Guys, we just basically... Wait a minute. If I can just hold this province right here, we can basically just pinpoint this and then just destroy the rest of these men inside here and then go deal with these guys over here. Oh my goodness, that is a really ingenious plan. And we have basically bankrupted ourselves into this situation. Great. Uh, the only thing that would be of... It's not making much of a difference, I'm making much difference. Making a ton of difference. I'm gonna have to support my men by 50% now. Which is a sad thing to say, but we kind of lost all of our privilege to... Okay, I'm going to go move these guys up here to go destroy these guys. And you guys are going to be the engagers at first. Okay. For now, combine all you guys. I'm going to have you guys go destroy these guys. Combine for now. Kill each kill these guys. Seriously, let's wipe them out. Focus on, let's move up there. Okay, well I've basically stopped any Chinese men from coming into this border. That is amazing. Right here, guys. Right here. No more. They can't send any more men to come reinforce them. So whatever we have in here to deal with, that is the last of the Chinese. That's so exciting. Okay, so that means we can just start moving in freely. Oh my goodness. We almost have it all. All these victories, guys. All these victories. Destroy them, please. You guys can go actually over here. Just need some more men. 
taking down this province. Okay, you guys are going to where? Jinsu, go kill him. You guys go right there. You guys are done with the Zintin conquest. You guys go right there. You guys go right there. And now we are just starting to have open lands. And now we're conquering the capital of Beijing. And the Russians are starting to gain back their land over here. Oh my goodness. We won, guys. We won. Oh my goodness. We have basically crushed all of China. Not just crushed, but demolished them. They are completely at our whim. Gone. Just gone. And then the communists come. Of course. Of course. Cannot have a game without the communists spawning. Huh? When did the heck did the Russians? Ah, oh, great. When the heck did they come? Ah, oh, shoot. Okay. You better help me out here, Persians, because I don't think I'll be able to gain control over this naturally. And I basically helped out everyone. I mean, I've basically taken over all of China. Single-handedly taking over all of China. In fact, I better go send over more troops over here because I feel like they're not going to be able to deal with this. Because I don't need as many troops anymore over here on the battlefield. As I clean up the rest of these men. Oh, that was stupid. No, I'm gonna go into debt no matter what I do, so I might as well just support all these guys as much as I can. Cause I'm gonna go like I know I'm gonna go into debt, so there's no point in like trying to prevent it. I'm just that's how much debt I wanna go into though, that's the only thing. Oh my goodness. You guys move in. My goodness. Can you guys imagine, like, when we started back here, how much men we had to deal with? How much we don't have to deal with anymore? We've taken over Beijing. And now China is not a great power anymore. Really? 6% war goal? What the heck? Okay, well, I don't think, I think we kind of need these guys to defend their own land, so I'm going to give them, give them back command of their units, so they may go fight wherever they want to. Okay, I'm going to have you guys do a specific goal, and that is going to go take back my capital. You guys move in right there. Have we defeated all these guys yet? No, we have not. Well, these guys could be... These guys could go kill those guys. Let's move in more down here to our zoo. You guys move in right there. You guys go destroy these guys. And... separate from the Russians okay it's all done guys the ultimate defeat of the Chinese is done fall of Beijing everything we're done now I'm sending more men to go back to go protect my land because I have to realize I have a bad Beijing anti German force here and massive amounts of rebels and then moving in over here 
Also, the nicest things in the world. Friends horrendous. I did not notice that before. Alright. Now we can slowly move in over here. I mean, I almost have all the land occupied. Russia, please start... Please stop fighting back. I basically defeated all of the Chinese for you. I mean, th there are literally no more Chinese men over in China. I defeated them. I did much better than the, uh, than the Japanese did. Okay, I actually made sure they were all dead. They were, there was no, um, crazy communist leader leading them either, so that was good. Um, let's see, we're gonna need some good amount of soldiers here defending. Alright. I think with these two armies combined, we should be good enough to go fight against anything that's gonna try to... Okay, now you can go hunt down whatever rebels you want to. Oh my goodness, but now... Now we are just like... That should kill off all the rest of these guys. And now look at that. Look at that marvelous empire right there. Okay. And right there. And there we go, guys. That is how you defeat the Chinese Empire as a mighty powerful India. It took us much time of our own to do it. But we basically have them on the run. With them on the run, we basically can now go fight against um, Germany. But Germany has a pretty solid advance onto Russia. Probably going to be pretty hard to defeat them. So what I'm going to be hoping is that Russia gets a peace treaty by themselves and not with me. A way they declare peace but not gets me into it so that everything's going to be cool that way. Still can't call them in. And we destroyed, dang. The Chinese are all dead though. So don't count 500. So they basically have 428 left while we have probably just my men because the Russians kind of died so 517 so we're basically at this point where we're doing good and Romania has formed and Turkey is communist did not see that one coming and Romania is here but I think I'm gonna just cut off the break guys I've been talking for a very long time this war yeah it's long it's very long and we've been fighting for a very long time so I'm just gonna end the episodes, but it looks like, like seriously, it looks like the Russians are starting to get their stuff together. Act. I mean, the Chinese stopped advancing, so I know they did something, right? So yeah, once that happens, what we might do is then just go shift all of our army over here. Once we defeat all the Chinese, the rest of the Chinese remnants over here, shift all of our army to go help fight the Western Front, which is what a lot of you guys want me to do in the Second World War. Ugh, technically this is the first world war because that's the first one I'm fighting and that's the only ones I count, the ones I actually fight in. Because they actually are real world wars instead of those named world wars. But yeah, we have to really think of that. And there's no way these guys can get out of here because they're my puppet. So I'm glad they can't enter the war. But having that German force right here, we're going to have to go defeat, which we will do next time. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe. See you guys next time.